Now the next thing that we're going to do is we have to prepare this geometry for mid-surfacing. And as you can see, it has fillets and holes and things that we, we don't want to model. So now to do that, we're going to go over to the meshing toolbox and go to feature removal. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to move these small holes around these larger ones here because they're not necessary to represent the structure. So what we're going to do is we're going to move to the loops command. And to do this, you could select any curve on the circle, and that will get rid of it. So we're going to get rid of all these small holes first. couple ones. All right, now we have removed all the holes that we don't want to, to model. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to get rid of some of these fillets. So the fillets are going to cause issues with the mid-surfacing tool, so we want to get rid of those. And to do that, we're going to go over to the feature removal and select surfaces. Now fillets, you have to select all the surfaces in a loop to remove them properly, otherwise you can run into errors with the geometry modification. So we're going to select all the fillets in one continuous loop. And we can check the surfaces that we just selected by doing the highlight. So now we can see all the surfaces that we've selected. We click OK. And it got rid of all those surfaces and made nice, sharp corners. 